This is the story of a man named Stanley. He got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Okay. I've got my own office. And... Doesn't appear I've got any legs, though. Okay. Um. When Stanley okay. came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Door on my left. Okay. This was not the correct way to the meeting what? room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Well, of course. I did want to go through the employee lounge. Okay. Mm. Ah, yes. Truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully okay. constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. Mm. Pretty nice room. But eager to get back who's to business, Stanley took the him. first open door on his left. I want to know who's closing doors, that's who. Okay. And... I'm pretty sure you said go straight on, didn't you? Yeah, that looks ominous down there. Stanley was so bad at following directions, what? it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. No, I'm able to think outside of the box. I am not one of the sheeple. And I don't trust you. Well, Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've got not on the wrong this, foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize yeah. that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. Lies. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. Mm -hmm. Please, stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Now, I'm not asking for me, I'm asking for her. Huh? This is it, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself. To put your work aside. To let her back into your life. What, my ex? She's been waiting. She, yeah, she can continue to wait. No, no chance. Just like that door. Yeah, that will remain closed. <laughs> it should never be opened. Mm. Uh, That's her, Stanley. Nope. You need to be the one nope. to do this. To reach out to Should her. be blocked. If you Shouldn't can truly have my place your faith in another, block. Then pick. Oh no 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 no! You can't. Did you just unplug the phone? Yep. Now that wasn't <laughs> supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? No, you don't. You actually yeah, chose hang up incorrectly. The phone. I didn't even know that was possible. Well, Let you me do double now. check. Yeah. No, no it's just definitely block here. Clear your number. Stanley Remove picks up socials. the phone. He's taken to his apartment where he finds his wife, yep. and the two See? pledge themselves to Knew one it. another. Music comes in, fade to white, roll credits. Nah, that's not, not how it picking ends. Up the phone is actually somehow an incorrect course of action. That is the correct is course possible? of action. None of these decisions were supposed to mean anything. I don't understand. How on earth are you making meaningful choices? Ah, yeah, because I'm clever. You... Wait a second. Did I just see... No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. How had I not noticed it sooner? Mm -hmm. You're not Stanley. Uh, You're a real person. <gasps> see, now you begin to understand. I can't believe I was so mistaken. This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices. Mm -hmm. And to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. If you've made any more wrong choices, you might have negated it entirely. It's as though you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol what? for real-world decision-making. Or did you not grasp far. the severity of the situation? Well, I won't have that kind of risk on my watch. Risk. I'm going to stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly on safe decision making in the real world. Please observe this helpful instructional video. Oh no. Choice. Oh, it's the best it's part of being work. a real person. But if used incorrectly, it can also be the most dangerous. For example, in this scenario, a hypothetical real person named Rupert has a choice. Rupert. He could invent a machine that eliminates food shortages across the world oh. to make life better Bug for burgers. all people. Or he could spend years no. of hard work forgetting how to Don't read. Do that. Which choice would you make? Remember that Don't unlike here, bug, the bug real world burgers. makes That's sense. Disgusting. And at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. Okay. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, in all likelihood, that person is not real. Allow the person to finish their thought 
Then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, My goodness, is it 4.30? I'm supposed to be having a back sack and crack. That is a good excuse. I do use that one. Excellent. Making choices on a regular basis is the best part to a healthy decision-making process. No, it's not. Most medical professionals recommend making at least eight choices per day. Do you make more than eight? Less? I don't care. I don't and finally, care. if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution no, to the world, I don't just care. remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially insignificant. Well, that and is the feeling should true. subside. At this time, your instructor will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. Ah, welcome back. You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of narrative contradiction. But not to worry. Now that you're properly informed on good decision making, we're going to revisit a choice you made just a few minutes ago no, and no. see what the correct thing to do would have been. This way, please. No. No. He entered the door on his left. Okay. Door on my left. No! What? Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps we're not too late. No, no, no. Let me out, let me out. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was a whole underground facility. <laughs> you would have destroyed it and been victorious. It would have been so perfect. Uh, I worked so hard on it. I tried so hard to make... <laughs> All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay. Door on my left. No! Why did you do that? He entered the door on his left. Okay. No! Why did you do that? <laughs> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Ah. Uh, brilliant. Stanley? Yeah. Hello? Are you... Is everything okay? Stanley, please. <laughs> I... I need you to make a choice. I need you to walk through the door. I did. I walked through the door Are on the left. Are you listening to me? Can you hear me? Is everything all right? Well, you, Stanley, your game's broken. The story needs you. It needs you to make a decision. I did. It cannot exist without you. Do you understand me? <laughs> Whatever choice you make is just fine. They're both correct. You cannot be wrong here. We can work together. Ah. I'll accept whatever you do. I simply need you to take that step forward, please. Well, now you begin Choose. to understand. Do something. Ah. Anything. Thought I recognized all this the uni assets. Then you can ever know. I need this. The story needs it. So, you hear me? Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, oh. yep. <laughs> it's worse. <laughs> I might be remembering this wrong. <laughs> It's possible the story is back where we just came okay. from. Now this... Yeah. Well, I'll be honest, I don't recognize this place at all. <laughs> is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. You're right. It, is that correct? Yep. Hmm. Do you remember Stanley? Um, when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, oh, he entered the door on his left. Then you. Okay, door on my left. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, no, but and Stanley knew it perfectly the well. Correct way Perhaps to the he wanted to stop lounge. by the employee lounge first, just yep. to admire it. I do, but ah, I yes, am in a hurry. Truly a I room have worth admiring. Business. It had really been worth But pressing. eager to get back to business, Stanley yep. took the first open door on his left. But now, you see, that's not what I did. I went straight on into the cargo room. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's uh, incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Someone you've forgotten about. Uh, I know Please. where you're what? taking me. Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? What? Are you that convinced that I want something bad you're to happen to gonna you? You're going to try Why? and get me to speak to I don't to know my how ex. to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you. Nope. To show you something beautiful. She's not. Look, she's let evil. Let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Lies. Give me a chance. Now listen carefully, this is important. Okay. Stanley walked Ooh. through the red door. Yeah. Collectible. You found one of them. Nice. Okay. Um what did he say? Uh go through the blue door, wasn't it? Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. 
Stanley walked through the red door. Okay, well, I don't believe that. I'm pretty sure you said blue. I still don't think we're communicating properly. Stanley walked through the red door. Blue. All right, fine, go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let yep. me stop you. Yep. You see? There's nothing here. I knew it. I haven't even finished building this section <laughs> of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. The game's broken. broken. rooms, exposed developer textures. Yep. Is this what you had wanted? I've exposed Was it you. worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Yes. Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? No. Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. <laughs> Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable oh, desires of yours. What would have made this game better? Dinosaurs. What did you want to see? Dinosaurs Vehicles? and taming. Skill trees? No. Work with me. You've given me absolutely nothing so far. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can okay. give me some feedback. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Okay. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Stanley! Oh. Pick up the bucket. Oh, you're forcing me to pick up the bucket now. I don't want the bucket. Let me up. I suppose... I'll do this one thing. Stanley picked up the bucket. Take the bucket this time. But I'm running straight to the employee Stanley lounge. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his... This was not the correct way to the meeting room. But Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him. Telling him that the employee lounge was simply the place to be. No, it's and here saying it was. go to the cargo Had the bucket lift. turned out to be correct? No, oh. never mind. The bucket was wrong. <laughs> Stanley took the door on his left no, he didn't. to go back to the meeting room. <laughs> no, said the bucket. <laughs> Don't go to the meeting room. Go somewhere else. The cargo lift, no, yes. Let's go to go the there. instead. Go to the cargo lift. No, we go down here. <laughs> This is day number 295, tape number... <laughs> I don't even know. I've lost track. Nothing feels real anymore. The longer I study this bucket, the less sense anything makes. The sheer euphoria I feel every time I pick it up. No matter how many times I've done it, it's always the same feeling. And the emptiness in my chest when I set it down. It doesn't make sense. There's no explanation for it. I still haven't figured out why I see the world so differently when this bucket is in my arms. Why everything feels so... What do I do with this treasure? I can... I can monetize it. It's unthinkable the amounts of money people will pay for even just an hour with the bucket. This is my golden ticket. But I have to be careful, because as soon as this gets out, there's going to be a target on my back. Even now, I don't know who might be trying to get me. What's that? Who's there? 